Hello, welcome to Ron Polanski Laptop Repair. Uh, today, laptop of choice is uh, A. So I get letters every day. Uh, people send them in through the uh, the interweb. Uh, on the the in I get in my inbox. It's a uh, Ron Polanski. Uh, so I click on letter and open it up, and there's words. The the words are usually uh. A couple letters long, followed by spaces in between them, so that you know that it's not just one word. Uh, and the words usually say something like, Hey, Ron Blinsky, uh, uh, fucking, I can't get the thing to work! And then you go, and then I, I send them back letter with words, and I, sh I tell them how to do it. But today, I show you how to do it on video. Most common problem I get asked about is a uh, very big problem, and uh, I get asked so much that we make video demonstration clip. Larry! No, roll the clip! Roll the clip! And now, for laptop correspondent with PC repair, Chuck Buckley. Hey guys, welcome to Chuck Buckley's Laptop Repair. Today you're going to need a couple of things. You're going to need a paintbrush, a toothbrush, a hammer, and a chisel. Now, the first thing you got to do is take your, take your paintbrush and you just, just get off all that, that wood dust and, and semen residue and you just, you just brush that clean off. You can now open her up. You got a clean surface to work with. Now you just you open you open the laptop right, and you flip it around. Now, as you can see, this here laptop has uh, it's got a nice broken screen, right? We're gonna fix that, and we got we got this open here, and then you you, you grab your tooth you grab your toothbrush, and you just lightly dust the power button. Once the power button is all cleaned up, you can start working. Now you grab you grab your chisel and you find which keys aren't quite working and you just you just fucking give that a good give that a good good whack and you just you lift it. Once the keyboard has been lifted from the console, you just fucking get your hand under there and you just fucking you just rip that cocksucker right out, right? Once the keyboard's removed from the console, you just you put that and you start fixing the keys. Now you get that in a nice stable stable condition on the uh, the table there, and you just fucking fucking give that a good whack. And uh, once once the keys are see these keys are supposed to be dented here. See that? And you got you got some missing ones. Then that's how you know you're all good, right? You put that back. You put that back on the console, and you just fucking get it in there. Now, as you can see, the power button has actually come off of the lap. This is this is what you want because you don't need this power button anymore. Because we're using we're gonna mod this. All right. Now, once once the keyboard's back into the console, you're gonna need to stick it back in there somehow. So you grab it. You grab your uh, you grab your saw, right? And you just score the top of the keyboard. Or the laptop, sorry, and you just, you want to get a nice cut line in there, right? And you just fucking, once you got a good line, you just fucking, you close her back up, turn it around 360 degrees, right? And you open her up, you, op you open her up, right? And then, then we can start working on the insides. Keeping up with the old uh, YouTube trends and all your, your crazy fucking laptops and your iPads and your whistle wadgets. Now you're going to want, we're going to mod this so that it's actually a touchscreen portable tablet, right? And then you won't even need this part anymore because it's all just going to be in here, okay? Now, first thing you want to do is you just want to give that a good fucking whack, right? You just want to make sure that you got a nice good dent in the middle of it. Because we're gonna put the, uh, we're gonna open this, this, yeah. See, we're gonna rip this layer off, right? And then we can, we can get a, uh, we can get the touchscreen mechanism. We can get that right in there, right? You just want to fucking get, you just want to make sure all this shit's gone, and you just keep, you layer, you get that layer off of there, right? And then once you got a nice white uh, 
backdrop here you can you can start putting in the servos right right around there and you just want to fucking give the corner a good smash see now we got the light in the back it's going to help us uh, with the navigation because we're going to need to see uh, where we're going when we start getting that. You don't want that either. That's that's garbage. And you're just going to want to, yeah, you're going to need, this part you need though, you're going to want to put that somewhere. You ain't going to lose that. And then uh, once you got this, this nice, this nice well lit silver area, we can start with the, the touch screen modding. Now once you remove the layers, uh, you can start uh, well, we'll get the touch touch screen servos in there. So you want to grab you want to grab a piece of screen, okay? And you just want to you want to fucking okay. Now this this part is uh it's pretty complicated. I'm not going to go into detail here, but basically this thing is going to be what's activating your uh, your touch screen uh, functions here. Now you just don't need that anymore. Okay. Now another thing is there's a layer of plexiglass behind all of that and that that you don't need either so you just you want to get that out of there and uh, once you remove all the key components from the, from the back of the screen you'll see what you got here is this black square and uh, a couple of uh, microchip boards up here and uh, that's that's what it's supposed to look like all right so you grab you grab your keyboard and you just make sure that's nice and in there Nice and just give that a couple of wax, you know, just make sure it's nice tight in there. And uh, now you take your, uh, you take your, take your, you take your M key, or it could be the W key, I don't know, because it's like the same thing. And uh, you, you stick that, you just stick it in there, and you grab, you grab your, you grab your chisel, and you just, you just lightly scrape the, the black square from the middle of the screen. Okay, so uh, it appears I might have damaged uh, the internal uh, hard disk component, but that's fine. I can fix that. So until until that problem is resolved, you're gonna wanna you're gonna wanna just close the laptop up nice, and you wanna. You're gonna want to flip it all around, okay? You just take the battery, you take, you take the battery out, and you. Well, I'm sorry, folks. This battery is really fucking. Fucking come on, come on, come on! Fuck! God damn it! All right, fucking Ron, we'll we'll go to you and, and fix this shit up. So thank you, Chuck, for totally fixing laptop. As you can see. Perfect working order now. All keys, all keys functional, and uh, touch screen very well placed with uh, handcrafted mastery. Now, uh, I'm sure many viewers find helpful. Uh, Run, Polacy, you're under arrest for the publication of child pornography, gun laundering, and drug trafficking. Well, folks, thanks for watching Ron Polanski Laptop Repair. Uh, I'm really glad y'all tuned in, cause you know, it was totally fucking worth it, cause that video was so great, and it was just completely fucking- From the middle of the screen. Um, you might want to turn it off. Hold it in. <laughs> That's the hard disk. That's all that is. Okay. It's just the disc spinning. <laughs> <laughs> 15 miles to the gallon. Fixed it. <laughs>